has a high impact permit to monitor and protect the banded dotrel, the Tuturi foxu, in three areas. One area is here at Eastbourne Foreshore, and this is on the eastern side of the Wellington Harbour. The other two areas are down on the south coast of the Wellington, uh, on the eastern side of the harbour entrance in Pincaro and Bering Head. Uh, over the last six years, uh, we've taken the nesting success out at Bering and at Pencaro from 3% to over 50% through our methodology controls. But here at Eastbourne Foreshore, unfortunately, our nesting success over the last six years is only between 0 and 10%. And the only difference between our, our uh, methodology between these three areas is here at Eastbourne, we do not target cats. That's because, of course, the Eastbourne Foreshore uh, is where the Dotrols breed is within 50 meters of houses, so it causes a real issue. We have tried to do a number of things at Eastbourne. Uh, we have uh, gotten the Eastbourne Scouts to deliver a brochure through houses within a kilometer of the area. That brochure is really about keeping cats safe. We didn't take the tack that cats kill. We said, keep your cats safe, keep them inside at night. And on the other side of the brochure is a bit about the banded Dotrol. Now, we've actually uploaded that brochure onto this website, so you can take a look at that brochure. The solution to this issue really is, and as multiple local authorities have different rules and different laws on, on cat control. Here in the hut, we have no laws. So right now, you can have a cat, not microchip, not neutered, not, not anything. What we really need in New Zealand is a national law which states that you keep your uh, cats neutered, keep them microchipped, and also within a kilometer, we'd like to see within a kilometer of any endangered species, keep the cats inside at night time would be our solution. I am a cat owner and I do agree that cats are fantastic companions and we did keep our cat inside at night. It took six months for the cat to get used to being inside at night with lots of sleepless nights but now he's a very happy cat inside and our dog was the same.